Welcome! It's the Black Rainbow. I'm going to do your reading and it is the 3rd of September, nearly the 4th. Welcome! I'm going to shuffle your cards on screen basically <laughs> to connect with you all. I hope you're doing amazing. Thank you for stopping by. Everyone, thank you for your comments, for your likes, for your love, for your support. I really appreciate. So let's just dive into your energy and see what is coming up. Um, we are in Virgo season. Happy birthday if anyone is celebrating Virgo. <laughs> Any Virgos are celebrating. Otherwise, we are celebrating with Virgo. <laughs> I do know a few Virgos myself in my family. So I'm using the Babylonian Tarot deck and it is from Roxana Paul from Etsy. I will also clarify. All right. I am almost ready to do your reading. Looking at what you have in front of you and where you want to go, you are watching people perhaps get promoted or change, uh, you know, country or job or partners you are you are watching people get on with stuff and you know that you can also get on with stuff but you're not sure if you're ready and you're also holding on to something you do are you are still focusing on now there has been in the recent time celebration perhaps you are reconnecting with with friends or family there is definitely friends around you wanting to reconnect with you you might be connecting with two girls that you haven't seen for a long time, girlfriends or boyfriends, I'm seeing friend circle to people that, yeah, uh, you could really like be close even if you haven't seen them for a long time, suddenly they pop up and you're like, oh, I, it's like an acquaintance slash friend, someone that has popped up in your life, perhaps this person had Pisces in their chart or you have Pisces. Um, okay, so there is a, a timeout or there has been a timeout um, and um, this person, okay, let's pull out all the cards. Strong Pisces energy here. Yes. Uh, we have also Cancer. Okay, we have Libra. And we have the Ten of Pentacles. Okay, I'm going to clarify. So a person that you are dealing with, um, maybe strong Libra or Cancer. This person could recently have become single or there's something they're focusing on that is independent from what they've been doing before. They're focusing on a win, a financial win perhaps, and it looks like that is happening. This person might take a break, a holiday or something because it has been a difficult period. They have put on a brave smile. When it comes to you, they could be sort of acting like they ran away, but that isn't the case. It's something they had to deal with. I am not picking up like an ex at the moment. I'm picking up maybe someone that uh, moved towards you but you didn't get um, an opportunity basically to, to get close. Um, I am also picking up another energy here with the Knight of Pentacles. But uh, okay, let's just dive into this energy and see what comes up. Spirits, please uh, clarify the Knight of Pentacles, the Justice. Yeah, so... Okay, uh, this person is kind of sleeping on needles, <laughs> walking on eggshells, sleeping on needles, uh, because, because there might be, okay, so there is a, there is a mother figure, mo mother, mother of their children, uh, I feel that it's a bit delicate, the situation, the justice keeps coming up, so there are, constantly having to think about am I doing this right 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 and there it gets to a point where they can't just do things right because otherwise something will not uh, move forward uh, they might have a child so that if they have left someone there's a divorce or there's a separation it is possible um, there is also a tower moment uh, maybe there is a settlement as well. I feel here that, um, so I feel here that this person actually is 
kind of it's you that is showing up in their environment is you they are seeing as the the one that is um abundant the one they want to give an offer to but i see that to have a breakthrough there's going to be a tower moment and there will be resistance about them moving forward but they will move forward but i see that they are there is something on a shaky ground here they might have a child I don't know if it, this has to do with uh, like a spouse, partner type of thing. I don't really get this as a, um, this type of situation. It could be another situation around them where they have to follow some kind of law and order. But here, um, I'm seeing here, this will, with the tower and the justice and the five of swords, it looks like they have to do things their way and they will not get this approved. Whatever they're about to do, they're not going to get this approved basically. So they're going to have to, to do it. They're going to have to <clears throat> do it their way because they're pursuing their happiness. So um, this could come as a shock to you that this person will suddenly do something out of the... <clears throat> Well, just out of the blue, basically. Um, and you could see this person as someone that definitely will not do something crazy or do something that will cause any chaos, make people talk or break the law. <laughs> it does look like this person, uh, it's like they're prepared to um, to do that. <laughs> and they are prepared, prepared to do quite a lot to, to come forward. Um, so why do we have the Knight of Pentacles and the Ace of Swords for the collective, please? The sun, yes. Uh, so this person could have slowly but surely invested in uh, you, but then they left or they just vanished. So you could have been like, well, well, I guess I will, will continue to give love to myself. You could have felt sad. You could be walking away from someone. You could have been in a difficult energy uh, collective where you feel that there's too many obstacles. You could feel sad even. You just feel like, oh, I don't know if I have courage to do what I want to do. You could have felt a little bit or gone through a period even right now where it's like it's you feel a bit drained um, by like having to constantly think about walking away. Like this time, you don't really want to walk away, but I see that you, like with the Eight of Cups, you could feel very sad that you have to walk away, uh, but then something happens. Um, what is going to happen here with the Eight of Cups? Eight of Cups for the collective. Hmm. I do see... Um, Suddenly, someone is um, okay. Yeah. So, collective, there is there is a lot of bickering around you. Um, this is something that is not going to be going unnoticed, and even if you slow it down, it will be noticed at some point, and there will be you walking away from something it could be a person at this stage because i feel there's two people one that is slowly but surely coming towards you you're feeling happy there is a celebration but there is someone coming in quite strong i mean they're very strong that pushes you to walk away from there is people in between or there is see justice again i mean this is what you deserve it's rightfully yours I pick up like something will happen that could make you feel feel awkward and it could make you like okay on in my imagination this sounds about right this is what I want in love but then on paper or actually in 3D you could be like this is mega awkward I am suddenly in this situation I feel this destined but why is it so many people watching this unfold and we have the strength and the ten of cups and we have the ten of pentacles in the final outcome so you you're gonna have to pluck up courage or to do something that you never thought you will do but you will do it but it's like right now you'll be like no i won't do it uh, or i can't see myself doing it you could feel just awkward and just cringing and just feeling like 
I can't see how this will unfold at all, but there is a situation that will unfold in a way that you are moving towards someone, expressing love to one another, and quite openly so, and you are not actually expecting that this will happen at this moment when you're watching the reading. Um, there might be friends or you will get a little help to to feel, I see you have someone around you that will clap their hands, they will be like, okay, we'll give you a helping hand, moral support, moral support. You will have that around you and that will feel good because there are definitely, there's a whole crowd that isn't supportive or there's a lot of people that, that will be like, what? I don't know why, but uh, you, you will know when that happens. There, it, it's just like, a situation that you feel is oh I'm stepping on people's toes or I don't know why but there is this kind of situation um, your intuition however is saying that yes you have the courage to do what is about to unfold it is your <laughs> it is it is your destiny in love it is what you, what is meant for you I do see this person as well opening up we also have the Emperor here um, I do think that there are there are a lot of people in this reading. There is a lot of people that has something to say. And you could also be coming out of Hermit. And we have again the Ten of Pentacles and the Strength. So, okay, there is a destined union here that is meant to be. Meant to be. And right now, they know that you have their eyes closed to them, but they feel still that there is this sparkle, sparkle going on. They don't know why, but they feel that you, there's someone here that have not revealed their love to you. Maybe they have, maybe they haven't. They haven't really revealed their love. They are, you know them, but you don't know them. You don't, uh, you haven't yet um, had like open up and told you, told them you love them or they haven't told you they love you. They haven't showed you a love language, perhaps flirtation, perhaps more gestures, but this is about to unfold like, okay, they'll be there with an engagement ring almost. They will be like there where you live. They will be like in your environment every day, that type of, like that's quite full on. <laughs> so this person is prepared to just be there, be there with you. And this is happening quite fast. I do see someone inviting themselves, so they are arranging an event where you will meet. You will know that they are there when you go there and you could feel quite um, like, oh, my life is about to change. Many of you have gone through a spiritual awakening. Many of you will also feel a bit um, sad or many of you are coming out of a time where you've had a tower moment, you had difficulties. Like many of you are coming out of a difficult time, but this is not going, and, and it's, with the Eight of Cups appearing, it's almost like wipe your tears. Um, now, now it's time for you to enjoy um, enjoy this romance that is here for you. You have one foot in the doors elsewhere. There is a bit of chaos. You're not sure how this will unfold, but it's like you will. You are aligning at the moment, so be patient. You're going to be in a strong position. You're going to be in a strong venture. There is someone here that could have Aries or Leo in their chart. They are going to vouch for you. They are going to stand up for you. This could be a boss um, or business owner. There could be a new job as well. Um, there could be a friend or family member, someone queen of wands that is also um, by your side. This person could have Pisces and fire elements in their chart. I feel that you suddenly have people supporting you that you never thought you would have. Like, it's almost like you have people coming to the rescue uh, for you and making everything like smoother. And you might have people that you thought will be there to, for the rescue, but they are actually against you. But no one is really against you, I would say, because with the with the five of ones, it's like, that could be banter, that could be people teasing, that could just be, okay, they're not supporting, they're not really against you, but they're, they're quarreling, they're, they're gossiping, but it's not really going to, 
to sabotage anything but it's like oh my god like there's a lot of that oh my god oh my god like there's like a jungle telegraph going on and um, this person here though they're like they could have libra in their chart libra libra aquarius uh cancer for sure leo is here as well uh, scorpio but they're like okay here we go here goes nothing someone is saying like here goes nothing <laughs> And there, then there's a tower. There's like, okay, they're saying something, they're doing something, and then suddenly there are so many people talking. Yeah, see, everything, everything, everyone's coming out of the coffins. The love is out. The love is out, like, out in the open. Someone is like shouting off the rooftop that there is love. Someone is not holding back. It's, uh, yeah, see, again. Uh, judgment yeah the judgment is here again and we have the yeah so you could be going from like single happily single into a ten of cups relationship here we have the ten of uh, sorry the, the the king of pentacles you have options around you as well, uh, collective. So choose wisely. I don't, I don't feel someone is going to, I don't feel here this is a, not a choice between, or it's not, it's not like this type of situation where you are dating for a while and then you are, oh, let's see, maybe this one today, maybe this one tomorrow. It's not like that. I feel here the emperor is embodying the four kings. The empress is embodying the four queens. There are people that is interested in you. There are people that you are still interested in. Mind you, this is coming on very fast, very, like it's not any notice at all. This could be someone that you have feelings for, but it's, oh, I haven't, I mean, you could have even known this person for some time, but, it has been an awkward, like, it's almost a bit awkward I'm picking up. Like, or it has been a bit, like, in your imagination. Maybe this person, but then you've been saying, no, that's not, I'm not going to have courage for that. Because there is some conflict. There is, it's like a, uh, yeah, you will feel awkward. A gift. This person, yeah, they are thinking about you, worth waiting for. Okay, so if you're dealing with a main male, uh, this is someone that you are releasing. You have already released them and that's how you are, are attracting in this divine counterpart. This is someone that you have manifested. So stay optimistic, wipe your tears, it will be playful. There, this is a pathway that you have cleared. Someone will be in despair uh, because they will lose you, because it's the last time, or the last time they were with you is the last time, or someone else here uh, very soon. This, I'm getting like, there's only one road two people are going, and that's to be with the other person forever. It is not uh, a fling, it is not... Mm, okay, we're going to get awkward and we're going to cause a lot of um, discomfort only to just separate anyway. So we have done all that for nothing. Because this person, maybe this person have, there is something about them. Why is the, why is the tower and the five of swords here? Why is that? Yeah. See, they're saying, no, I've sacrificed enough. They feel very connected to you they feel that okay they they try to play it safe they try to hold back but they are saying no not not anymore so it can also be yeah they're they're going with their intuition they really feel that they have to come forward uh we have pisces virgo there can be someone here that was sort of in uh, trying to stop this but I don't think it's going to be possible. There can be someone here that, yeah. I see there is someone here that will gossip, that will try to put some spanner in the works for this person. That There is something like that here. That's that's for sure. But I, I don't see, it's got to do with a soulmate that have, you know, this, this connection have ended. Um, but this have ended and they're coming towards you. Um, yeah. There is 
there are competition for you that you don't even know about. Uh, collective, it's you you don't even know about it. And and there's like this all, all of this is happening in the background and yeah, you could just feel why is all this happening? Uh, um <laughs> Is energetic but yeah if you're dealing with a Leo Aquarius I mean someone here is very jealous of them moving forward and becoming the best version of themselves someone is very jealous that they didn't you know make it with this person and they didn't really bring out the best best in each other so is that that thing going on I'm not really getting like a karmic like a karmic sort of situation that's going to play out here I don't but I do get people around them and people around you bickering about this connection so behind there there could be someone that almost got married but this is no second chances both of you could for instance have these karmic connections but you know it's clear as the day where you're going now so so that's not going to be um a doubt here so maybe someone that had outdated thinking will regret they will regret this um you know, walking away, they will regret not moving forward. There's also a girl with a snake coming up. So there, there is something about gossip. So someone that hears about this in a party or someone, someone is going to love to gossip about it. They're like, oh my God. And this person that is gossiping about it will also have to eat their words because they are going to gossip as if someone is doing a taboo oh my God, did you hear so-and-so? And then they are going to look stupid because this person's doing that of insecurity and they are doing that to a couple that will be <laughs> together forever. So this person will look like a fool, but there is someone like that around them, I think. Yeah, this uh, page of cups. I see that uh, the two of you will not be uh, affected by it. They're very sweet. They are... They are showing you slowly but surely. Uh, they are being a little bit strategic as well. All right. Uh, they are trying to sort of um, give you time maybe to walk away from your old life here. <laughs> um, they're trying to be patient. They are putting you on a pedestal here, um, collective as well. I see that you, it is you that is that is hiding from this person <laughs> because I feel here um, basically you are walking away from something else in your life that is a little bit hard to walk away from it has to do with a, a lifestyle you think you love or a job you think you love and then you know you don't love it but you're kind of a little bit stuck it's like that it's not easy to just change if you're a fixed sign, even more difficult to change uh, as well. And it's like you're a little bit frozen and and, and uh, there will be also gossip around you and this person. It's something about it's making you a little bit frozen and then you're like, oh, well, you know, I'm having a good time here now. But, you know, you're, gonna, you're about to have a much better time. Um, I, I see things... There will be a phase or there will be a period, let's say, where you and this person are getting close and you feel like there will be, I'm seeing that you are freaking out a bit because things are happening very fast and, and there is someone that's going to say something, uh, like they will say something to, someone is going to say something about you or them or both that is going to be like stirring and because you don't know each other that well you will be like oh shit what have I done am I meeting another person that is you know like my past or that's what they're saying as well so there there will be people talking about this connection so it's like keeping in mind that if people talk about a relationship that hasn't happened yet and if you are just ordinary people like then it must be because of jealousy right <laughs> it must be because this 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 union is quite, quite uh, strong and uh, I, I see that you are very suitable and, and they do love you. So it has to do with, with jealousy and people just like wanting to, to talk basically. 
They are coming in to offer you commitment. See, both of you are walking away from another commitment here. Um, yeah, they are traveling. They could change countries uh, as well. All right. They are leaving from somewhere. Where maybe they live for a long time. See, double confirmation of King of Cups. They will feel victorious uh, once they've, uh, you know, brave, been brave enough to, um, to come forward. You will be stunned how how many people is actually involved like in what what's about to happen in your love life you will be stunned uh collector you'll be like why like it's almost like you're this like celebrity couple like the whole world or even the tv channels are are filming you and it's like wow um there is also a person here i think they have either virgo or leo in their chart or virgo aries maybe Scorpio, this person, yeah, there is someone here that you will walk away from, they can feel you walking away, you already have walked away, but they have kind of been enjoying that you are stuck on them a little bit in your head, at least, or they think that they, there's someone there that think that they can um, have you back, this person's either Virgo or Aries, yeah, double confirmation of that, uh, this person you have a um connect like a uh, telepathic connection or at the moment it's just someone that is actually just making you feel stressed <laughs> it is down to that now <laughs> you because you have actually walked away from this person but the person that is coming into your life the king of cups you will have to walk away from everything because this day will be everything and you want this person to be everything but you will feel some kind of bittersweet you will feel that oh i don't know because there is also someone that will make the situation a bit uncomfortable i, I do see this person is dealing with something that isn't ideal someone will like flare up something like there will be like a jungle telegraph going about something that is, you know, they, they are going to cause some kind of drama here, for sure. Like, there is just someone here that will want to say something and there will be gossip. This person is insecure. Uh, yeah, that that's, that's here. Um, it's because this person, like, it's something about their fame. They could all... They could even have like been in a relationship and now they're they're becoming famous for what they do, their talents, and they are leaving the person they're with and they're coming towards you. You aren't really looking for this person and their talent. You are looking for their love and they are giving you the love that you are looking for and you are giving them the love you're looking for. So the two of you are not really coming together to create fame between the two of you. But see here, the, the King of Cups and the Queen of Cups, they're very casual, right? Suits off, gloves off. It's just pure love. It's not about a uh, power couple or, oh, I, I want to I wanna have your, you know, <laughs> I, I want to put your name out there and I want everyone to know because you are famous. It's not like that. So I think that is maybe why there is so much ruckus around this connection because, yeah, it is very genuine. They know you from the past. I feel that um, they are doing something that is a childhood dream and yeah, something about them making money of a childhood dream as well. Um, that is coming up. I do see that you are both uh, very independent. They could have Sagittarius, Leo in their chart. You're both very independent. You're going to do your own thing. But yes, you are going to move into a union. There is potentially one person here that thought you were single they will show up this could be someone that isn't a karmic connection it's part of the five of wands here i don't really see this is going to be a problem but someone here with an old school mentality in despair they will be like there is someone here i'm, I'm picking up like driving their car like coming in just as you're about to walk down the altar i mean hypothetically speaking with this person you already are going to be with this person they're like oh, I'm back after like 10 years or something. <laughs> someone that maybe they were the one that got away or you were the one that got away. There is someone like that here. I believe that they have Virgo in their chart because this is someone that is slowly and you're like, or Leo, you're like, what the earth? 
well, but, but they are just, they are going to be, they're not going to do anything. They're going to have to walk kindly away. They'll be like, oh, well, I guess, um, you know, it's like they are, they already know that, well, you have walked away from them now or they walked away from you. So, you know, it's, it's, it's done. It's not, <laughs> this connection is moving forward. Uh, but this person will be sad. There is someone that is suddenly, and, and they are, this is someone that want what they can't get as well. Maybe they have, have this person, this karmic. So there's a third party here of some sort, but um, anything else for the Empress and the King of Cups for the collective? Three of swords, yes. Broken heart, separation and grief, the temperance. So you will heal from, there's a separation or grief or something you are moving away from. Yeah, see here in reverse, the four of cups. So I feel here, yeah, someone that is coming out of the cold and wanting to heal the connection is going to be too late. Uh, page of Wands, see, in reverse. I feel here that uh, it's going to be too late. There is a person reaching out to you. Uh, yeah, it's like way too, too late. Now, you will have victory, progress. There is a milestone. Someone is coming in with gifts. Yeah, you will definitely have to decline someone and you will receive more than one offer here, collective. Uh, I'm seeing this. It, I mean, this could, <laughs> this could turn into a soap <laughs> opera. This could turn into a soap for sure. You are like suddenly like the offers are flying in. But I feel here the person that you are moving forward with is the king of cups. Because, because this person, they don't necessarily, is a water sign, it could be, definitely could have cancer in their chart, but it's because they are very honest and very direct and they are not afraid to show you and the world that they love you. Someone else here have been taken forever, but they will also come in with a message, but they will have to wipe their tears. You have already wiped yours and they have hurt you in the past. You have been healing from this connection. You might have Sagittarius, Libra in your chart, um, collective, uh, you, have been healing from this connection in the past and they did really hurt you as well. Some of you might have Sagittarius, again I'm saying, and Leo, maybe Aquarius, Pisces. So yeah, let's leave it at that. Please like, subscribe and share the video. I will see you very soon. Take care.